This is the new informatics school. This is the opening of the, that, this wonderful institution. This is combining the technological might of, uh, of the university and this informatics uh, centre world leading. Well, informatics is the study of information uh, and this is not restricted to just computers and uh, computing machines but rather uh, the processing of information which comes from a variety of fields. So could be from healthcare, could be from um, meteorological studies it could be things that you do in everyday life like um, cook something or use your uh, sort of wash, washing machine and basically the process of operating it always involves a certain set of sensory inputs that go in and sensory outputs things that come out and it's the processing of that is what we generally call informatics. Over the last 35 years we have built up six extremely strong groups uh, working in different parts of informatics. They've been working on robotics, They've been working on speech technology, uh, they've been working <coughs> on machine learning. This allows those six groups to work together. So for example, the people doing the robotics get the benefit of the machine learners and the computer vision people. I had a go at uh, the robotic technology. I've always had a bit uh, of fun, you know, boys with toys, that sort of stuff. And I was telling folk that I used to like Giganto. And I, I saw a robot that reminded me of Giganto. He was, he was pretty nifty, about unsteady in his feet, but he seemed to know what he was doing. I saw some of the robotic arm technology. I mean, it's so useful, obviously, in medical. People have lost uh, lost limbs. Uh, I mean, the new technology is just absolutely fantastic. What can be done, what's being developed here uh, in terms of uh, giving people the ability to sense, to touch, to feel, to control. Uh, it's all coming through, and it's going to be absolutely wonderful. It'll impact in all sorts of ways. Um, a lot of um, implications with regard to the workplace. So building robots allows us <clears throat> to have automated workers who don't get tired, who can work in dangerous environments. A uh, very strong in, uh, relationship to health. Using informatics we can model diseases, uh, we can sense whether people have got diseases, we can calibrate them and using very small computers uh, with sensors on we can for example calibrate some work on calibrating people so that if they show a symptom of a, of a disease which they're prone to then we automatically know about it. This centre exemplifies developing the talent and ability the human capital for people and attracting that from, uh, from elsewhere, the international excellence with the technology that allows industry and many fields of human endeavour that competitive advantage. So you've got competitive advantage and human capital together in this centre, the very essence of economic success for the, the future of Scotland.